This week, Governor Elliot Spitzer announced his resignation, saying he wants to spend more time with his hookers. Today, a desperate Hillary Clinton was spotted asking that hooker caught with Elliot Spitzer how much to do Barack. This week in Great Britain marked the Million Woman Rise, where a million women gather against oppressed and imprisoned women in Afghanistan, Africa, and Tom Cruise's house. John McCain is searching for a running mate whose presence will reassure Americans who are concerned about his age. So he's going with a paramedic. In other political news, Barack Obama raised $55 million this week, Hillary Clinton $31 million, and Ralph Nader found some bacon in his teeth. The U.S. Air Force is reporting that all original stealth bombers are being taken out of commission. Or so they say. With back-to-back -back wins in Wyoming and Mississippi, Hillary Clinton's attack ads are becoming more pointed. Her last one ends, is America ready for a coke-snorting Muslim? The Democratic National Committee has a plan to redo the primary voting in Florida. When he heard about the Florida recount, George Bush said, does that mean Al Gore is president? <laughs>